Hey everyone, so in today's screencast I just wanted to share how to create a quick tooltip in Articulate Storyline 360. So what I mean by tooltip is something that you could quickly hover over an element on the slide and reveal more information. So what we're going to do is show two different ways that we can achieve that and um, you can make a decision on how best to do that for your purposes. So here we have a cat in a box and the first method that I want to use is creating just a simple hover state. Now Storyline has a slew of built-in states and these states don't require additional programming to behave. So the first thing that we're going to do is click on our um, image we're going to create a state. So this is our normal state. And because I want the cat, the cat in the box to still be there, what I'm going to do is duplicate. Uh, sorry. I'm going to create a new state. Or sorry. I'm going to duplicate the state by adding um, a duplicate state named hover, which is a built-in storyline state. Add. Cool, now we have two cats in boxes. Now what we're gonna do is we're going to say, insert uh, a caption. Let's do that. I'm gonna put it here. Sure. We're gonna drag over the speech bubble. I'm gonna format it because I don't like the default colors. I don't know. Maybe we wanna make it the same color as the box. Okay, let's make it that color, no outline, and then I'm going to type in here, cats like sitting in boxes. Okay, and then I'm going to format that, remove the straight through, bold, we'll do black. Cool. So now we have a hover state that says cats like sitting in boxes. And I'm going to copy that so that I can show you the second um, option. So when we're done, click done editing states. We're gonna preview this slide. Now, when we hover over the cat without any additional programming, we're going to see the hover state. Cats like sitting in boxes. It goes away when you hover off of the image and it's just that simple. The other option that you have, um, so I'm going to delete this hover state. Done. We can add a layer. So we can create a layer. Let's call it hover. The reason you would want to use a layer is if you have some interactive content associated. So we're going to say cats like sitting in boxes these are some reasons why. And then I'm going to go grab a link. All right. And so I've got my link. I'm going to ins highlight, insert, hyperlink. Let's, uh, let's make it open in a new screen. And let's change the color of that to so then we create a trigger. So it's going to be show layer, hover. When the user hovers over, box cat. And then what we want, because we need them to click for additional information, we're going to uncheck hide layer when the user hovers out. So now when we preview, we're going to have our box cat, we're going to have our hover, and then we're going to be able to click the link. So now we can interact with this object versus it just um, providing information and then going away. So those are two ways that you can quickly create a tooltip in Articulate Storyline 360.